Problem solving and reasoning activities are a great way to challenge your students and encourage mathematical thinking. You can use our library of over 700 activities in lots of different ways, including modelling to your class and encouraging discussions around mathematical concepts to expand your students' learning. Let's get started. First, head to the Assign and Review section, then click Problem Solving and Reasoning Challenges. Here on your dashboard, you can pick your class and group. You can also select your level of difficulty. It's already set to align to your student's grade level, which for this Grade 3 class is Level 3. You can also access levels above and below if you need to set something easier or challenge your students with more difficult questions. You can filter your activities using the Playlists button. Playlists you've created and activities you've favourited in the problem solving area of the resource hub will appear here. There are also getting started activities, which are sets of 10 default problem solving and reasoning challenges for students. Using the history option, you can see tasks that you have previously assigned. You can filter these further by strand and by depth of knowledge, which is split into three levels. Depth of Knowledge 2 challenges students to apply their learning. Depth of Knowledge 3 questions extend on that, including questions with two-step problems. And Depth of Knowledge 4 questions can be open-ended or have group elements to encourage discussion. You can also filter by activity below. To access more information and preview an activity, click this drop-down arrow. Click here to preview the activity. Using Preview, you can even share an activity on an interactive whiteboard and work through it together as a class. You can also access the teacher notes for the activity, which have help for addressing misconceptions and useful teaching hints. You can assign activities in the drop-down with the Select or Assign All buttons. Alternatively, you can use these buttons to assign an activity to either an individual student or the whole class. Select your students and hit the Assign button. You can also select tasks and unassign them with the Unassign button. Selecting the eye icon will allow you to see the key for assigned tasks. Pale green means the activity has been assigned. Red means they have answered the questions incorrectly, blue for partially correct, and green means they have answered all questions correctly. This gives you a clear picture of where your students are struggling or excelling. A red dot next to a student name or activity means the student has sent you a question. To view the question, simply select the activity box and click Review Student Work. You can respond to their message in the activity or take note of it for when you next see them in class. With the Expand and Collapse buttons, you can see all your activity areas at a glance. You can also collapse and expand them individually by clicking the arrows at the top of each area. Lastly, just like the other assign areas, you can lock your students on task here. This will ensure they've completed all their assigned activities before moving on. Select Open Access to allow them access to all areas of Mathletics. And that's it! You can now take full advantage of over 700 problem-solving and reasoning activities to enrich and extend your students' learning.